Good morning, hot dogs, and welcome to your favorite morning announcements. Crash, Anime Club, Hooligan Show, and more after the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. If you missed Herf Jones yesterday, you can still order your cap, gown, and tassel online by using the link in the chatter if you didn't get yours. Remember, remember that there is a crash meeting tomorrow and Friday. If you cannot attend or if you have questions, contact or see Mrs. Johnson. Also, Anime Club will be having a meeting today, so don't forget to be there and don't be late. If you cannot show up, talk to Ms. Sham about it. Now to weather and sports. One. What's up, dogs? It's the first of the month, and it's hump day. Today for sports, we have girls' basketball results, wrestling, and more. The girls' basketball team faced the Sheridan Blackhawks last night. Both the JV and varsity fell with varsity losing 26-64. The girls will be back in action tomorrow, traveling to Delphi to take on the Oracles. Next up, the wrestling team will be having their first home meet tomorrow night against Western Boone. Make sure you stop by and support the wrestlers. The meet will begin at 6. The swim team traveled to North Montgomery last night. First place placers include Payne Teeter in the 50 freestyle with a time of 29.95. Mia Hernandez in the 1 meter diving with a score of 165.30. Georgia Myers in the 100 butterfly with a time of 121.01. Boys first place finishers, boys 200 medley relay consisting of Phillips, Santos, Craig, Cook, Skyler Phillips, and the 50 freestyle with personal best of 27.02. Ethan Cook in the one meter diving with a personal best of 170.15. Isai Jimenez in the 100 butterfly with a time of a minute and 15.27. Malachi Galishan in the 100 freestyle with a personal best of a minute and four seconds. The 200 freestyle relay consisting of Galishan, Jimenez, Santos, and Cook, Ethan Cook in the 100 backstroke with a personal best of a minute and 19 seconds. The swim team will be back in action tomorrow facing West Lafayette here at home. Last but not least, Boomer is coming to Case Arena. Boomer will be here on Saturday, December 4th for the Hot Dogs vs. Western Panthers boys basketball game. He will be here in the crowd during the varsity game throughout Case Arena. He will perform at halftime and will be out front in the lobby of Case Arena signing autographs and pictures during the third quarter. Make sure to come out Saturday and support the dogs and watch Boomer. That's all for sports dogs. Make sure you have a holly jolly Wednesday. Now let's send it to the weather boy. Thank you, Nelson. Even though it is December, it doesn't really feel or look like December. With the temperature being 39 degrees this morning, it feels like we're back in September. Today's high will be 47 degrees and the low will be 38 degrees. Today you can expect some rain, but it should end by the time we get out of school. That's it for the weather. Now back to your host. We have finals coming up December 15th through the 17th, so make sure to get, be ready for that. And there's about three weeks left, then we're off to winter break. The Hooligan Show is this Friday. Tickets are being sold at four or five dollars, five dollars, and will be sold at the door. Be prepared to laugh, cry, and maybe find love. For lunch today, lines one and two will be having country fried steak, and lines three and four will be cheeseburgers. Happy birthdays goes out to Josie Captain, Captain, Compton, <laughs> Eddie Flores, and Sophia Fox. Happy birthday, peeps. That is all for the announcements. Make sure to like and subscribe and hit that bell for more updates on your favorite HDV TV. Until then, we'll see you next time. <laughs>